Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Football Manager. This episode we take on the Chelsea under-18s. The starting lot for today is De Stegen in goal instead of Czech. Uh, on the, in defence we have Cellini, Alderweilder, Cahill and Azbequeta. The centre of the field we have Kevin De Bruyne and Giselli. The three attack midfielders for us is Hazard, Mata and Oscar. And I've decided to go with Falcao as a lone striker up front. The re main reason I wanted a friendly match against the under 18s is because I've signed quite a few quality under 18 year olds as well as some that's emerged from the young talent homegrown talent so it'd be interesting to see how they do on the bench though we have Pelle Cech, Ivanovic, Ashley Cole, David Luiz, Bruma, Jokinsei, Sissoko, Witzel, Robin, Kakuta, Fisker and Fernando Loriente got two players looking to like Cahill and Alder Wilder. Jose looked to gain confidence. Mata looks delighted. Hazard looks happy. A good pre-match team talk. Just want to see who uh, the under-18s are playing. Right, they've got Apostopoulos and Telio on the bench. Personally, I think they're two of my best under 18 year olds in that team. But this is Chelaney. I think he might have picked up a knock already. He's 84% condition rating. Giselli's been booked. But this is Dumont to Ganafi. And Melini. Figaro with a shot that got deflected and it's gone out for a throw. If we lose to the under 18s, it's not going to be a, a good sign. I won't be happy. But I'm interested to see if any of the under 18s have a good performance. Because if they do, I'll probably put them, bring them into the squad for a few games. But this is Azbukwaita. Still Azbukwaita now, Oscar. Matters there. Falcao's shot hit the post. This is Hazard though with the corner. Giselli's head had just gone wide. I think uh, we'll, I'll get Chilani off at half time. This is Hazard again with a corner. Immediately headers it away. Govier beat Aspaqueta, but Chelaney's found De Brune. Giselli. Now Aspaqueta. Shot deflected. De Brune back to Giselli. Cahill. Can't find it. De Boer heads it to Ganafi. Govier. Alder Wilder with a good tackle, though. Nice pass to Mata. Now Oscar. Come on, let's get a goal before half time. De Brune. Switch is flanked to Cellini. Now to back to Brune. Cellini. Chips in. It's Hazard. Oh, what a goal. Holy crap. What a goal. This is going to be a good highlight. When it loads, that is. Cellini with the cross. Falca headed it down. And Hazard with the volley very nice one minute of extra time or injury time should I say right end of the first half we are creating all the chances is anyone playing well for the under 18s no they're not Hazard's having a really good game at 8.2 but we're going to get Asbukwaita onto the left flank of defence and get Chelaney off for Jokin Says. Good response by everybody. Everyone looks delighted. All 11 players. Fantastic. I want to try and build morale up as much as I can. I want ideally all my players to be you know the highest morale as possible before the start of the season because I think it'll it'll certainly help towards having a good start of the season but this is matter Falcao oh just just missed matter did well to get the pass off to Falcao but just couldn't get the finish this is Giselli back to Asbukwaita Giselli found Asbukwaita again crosses it in Oscar hit the post we're creating opportunities, that's without a doubt. This Jockin says with a throw to Giselli. Now Jockin says again crosses it 
and Milini headers it away and Ganafi's got it. They're getting people forward. This is Tellio to Dumont. Giselli with the header away and it's to Boa. Brotherington to Apostopolis. And Giselli's been sent off. God damn. Right, okay. Not really the uh the way I wanted this to happen, but we shall continue. Apostopolis Lice is taking a free kick. Hit the wall, McGrath has got it. Apostopolis is there. And Molini on the volume. De Stegen with a really good save. This is Daboa. Brought him for £1.5 million. Beat a uh, competition from Man United to sign him. So I'm very pleased that we've got him. But this is Oscar. It's about Falcao. We need people in the box still. Falcao now jocking says. Has it Oscar? Awesome. Very nice. Jock and say with the cross. Murray just stopped Hazard from uh, shooting, but Oscar was there to get the finish. Awesome. It's De Stegen. They started to go as De Stegen in goal instead of Czech today simply because, you no, know, for the last three seasons of this series, Czech's been pretty much the goalkeeper for every single match. So I want I want to try and uh, keep De Stegen happy because I think he will be the eventual success to check. This is Jockey says with a cross and Falcao's there with the header. Very nice. Jockey says starting to get good at crosses. We see him cross from either the outside of the penalty box or on the edge of it. He's created a number of goals since I've signed him. We're going to make some substitutions. Um, we'll get Falcao for Loriente, Witzel on for De Brune, Robin on for Oscar, Kakuta for Mata, and Visca for Hazard. We'll get Ashley Cole on for Asbuqueta, Cahill. For Ivanovic and Alda Wilder for David Luiz. Try and build everybody's match fitness up and morale. But in terms of players who have had a good game for definite, Falcao, Hazard, and Oscar, so I'm very pleased with that. But Cole's collected that goal kick back to David Luiz. De Stegen hoops up the field. Laurenti's got it. Witzel. Now Robin. With a long shot, Shannon couldn't get to it. Loriente ran to it and Shannon got a fingertip save to stop Loriente. Says that the under 18s are going more defensive. Which, that's alright, gives us more opportunity to attack. This is Witzel with a free kick and somehow it's crept in. Very nice. Long range free kick. I think that just clipped the top of the upright to go in. One minute of extra time though. Blake with the goal kick to Mortimer. Apostopoulos. Ganafu back to Murray. Tries to find a cross for Brotherington, but Jock and says he's there to header it and Fisk has got it. Kakuta. David Luiz collects a loose ball and headers it to Witzel. Jockin saves, and that's full time. Right, match stats. We had 27 opportunities, 10 on target, 4 click chances. We had 61% possession. Our pass completion was 85%, tackles won was 75%, and headers won was 72%. We had 2 yellow cards, 1 red card. That was uh, Giuseppe that got sent off. The average rating for a player for us was 7.31, and the average rating for our reserve, uh, for our under 18s, was 6.44. In terms of who played well for them, 
the, the best player. 7.1 DeMont. A few players I'm disappointed with. Uh, Telio at 5.7. I thought he could have done better. McGrave at 5.9. Murray at 5.9. Ganefi got an injury at 57% condition rating. But in terms of for us, so Hazard, man of the match, 8.2 and got a goal. Falcao, 8.2 and got a goal. Oscar, 8.1. Witzel came on as a substitute in the 68th minute and got a goal and a 7.2 rating. So I'm, I'm pleased with that. Good performance. Good responses from the players as well. Right, we'll just... Uh, Right, okay, now I will be loaning Lukaku out simply because in terms of the squad registration for the Premiership, Diumba will not be uh, registered to play in the Premiership, so I'll be saving him for like Capital One Cup matches and FA Cup matches. But the bit of news that I want to say is uh, Falcao, Mitchell Beanie and Paul have signed new deals. I've loaned another player. Just... Uh, the transfers. Nathan Acker has gone to West Brom on loan. We've got the option to recall him, but personally I don't think I will recall him. I want him to get first team football and hopefully improve. But um, also we have got a new stadium. We've been given permission to build a new stadium. That stadium will be finished in two seasons time and it's going to be called Zola Park. I didn't know. I've never built a new stadium on Football Manager before so I didn't know if you come up with a name or if they give you a name already for it but the new stadium will be called Zola Park it's a 58,795 seat a stadium so that's 15,795 seats and more than Stamford Bridge the cost of the stadium will be £235 million we will get given £86 million from selling Stamford Bridge the club have taken out a loan of £149 million and the sponsorship deal for the stadium is £100 million. So yeah, very excited for the, the new stadium and that will happen in two seasons time. We'll be playing at a brand new stadium. But we'll have a look at our next pre-season friendly and it's against Santos. One of Brazil's, in my opinion, one of Brazil's best teams. Created a lot of good players in the past and that match will be at home. So it'll be the f second pre-season home friendly. But that is all for this episode, guys. Thank you for watching. If you like this episode, please hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And, uh, yeah, if, if you had any um, good names for a new stadium, what would you call Chelsea's new stadium? Or if you're a Man United fan, what would you call Man United if they had a new stadium? But that's all for this episode, guys. Thank you for watching. Take care.